writing about peace. It's, it's a fine line you have to walk. I don't know how many more songs we need scolding us for being so violent. <laughs> Angry songs about not being violent. Uh, I think that's run out of gas a little bit. You know, I have a feeling we're done with that. And uh, I got to thinking about the the causes of violence. We know so much more now about peace than we did 40 years ago. But people become violent when when three one of three things happens. You threaten their survival. You threaten their family's survival or you threaten their way of life. Those are the causes of war. Those are the causes of violence. And to prevent war, it's war is not Dick Cheney's fault. Uh, you know, he's he's a tool at the front. He's he's at the tip of the arrow, but we're the spear, you know, that's driving this whole thing. It's futile to blame politicians for war, I think. I think it's War and violence comes from consciousness, and it comes from inside of us. So I wanted to focus on the war that I wage every day in my resentments, in my anger, in my thoughtlessness, in my low-level cruelty. And that's where I can do something. Gandhi said, we, you know, all we can really do is carve out a zone of peace around our lives. I can't do much about um, Mumbai tonight. But I can, in my own life, vow not to manipulate people where I work and where I shop and not to deceive people. And that's really all I can do. And so I, I, that drives this song. It's called The Darkness in Me. Here in the dark of morning, when I rise, when I rise, I feel the storm clouds forming in my eyes, in my eyes.
in my bed, in my bed, carrying my daily bread.